So, Dexter the Helpful Cat, thank you. Being annoying, being in the way, appreciate it. Yep. So, have a Alto uh, key. Battery's already been put in. There's no blading here, but I'm gonna test this key out, try it out. So, yeah, I know, you're gonna be out of the way for it now, Dexter. So, to program with the M508, you will need to upgrade. The standard box that comes with this will not work. You need to add an upgrade to the XP400P or a couple more that will go with it. And Actually, you'll see that in here in a second. Universal key. So, like it's saying here, you only need to use the XP400, XP401, XP401 Pro, which is what the I have, or the XP401 Pro connect them. So, the standard one that comes with the machine, this one will not work. You will need to upgrade to the newer one. So, we're going to put that in there. Hit OK. We're gonna generate. I actually have another car I'm gonna be doing, and it's gonna be a surfboard key, if you have it right here. And I'm going to be doing that uh, next week sometime. While I'm doing it, I'm gonna program this card key to it to try it out, make see how it works, and see if I like it. So we're gonna go to Ford, because we're gonna Lincoln. It's a MKX, if I remember correctly, for 2011. So. We're gonna try this one here. So, gonna generate key. Ooh, that sound. We got light flashing. I do have Wi-Fi hooked up to the house, so we'll see how this goes. Now it's flashing. It was just on green, but now it's flashing, so we're upgrading. Yes, it's gonna help you. Yeah, if you could not bug me for a second, I'd appreciate it. Yeah, you're just gonna be in the way. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah.
Another thing I'll try. Now let's see what we got for the buttons here. Now, just a button. Let's see. Yeah, I, yeah. Thanks for being in the way. Thanks for being annoying, Dexter. Yeah, I appreciate it. So, as it says, it's this program to do trunk, lock, unlock, and panic. So, now that it's been programmed, maybe I want to change something else. I could change it to remote start. So, technically, the trunk button, it's labeled as trunk, I can now program as remote start. I think I'm going to try that and see how that works. Alright, so you can adjust the buttons and move them around. Good to know. So, if you went from remote start, trunk, and you can go back to trunk. Panic, go back to trunk. We'll go from trunk, and we'll try the remote start on it. Alright. Confirm writing. Let's do that. Thank you for waiting patiently. I appreciate it. So we've confirmed it. Remote start. Now we have it set up for remote start, not the trunk button which in Wisconsin is a lot more useful than the trunk unlocking. All right, so we'll try this in our video next when we program the key to that uh, 2011 Lincoln.